Good evening, everyone. My name's Heath Haskins, Code Primate. And before I get like a whole bunch of comments about, oh no, it wasn't lumber. I promise there's some, there is some lumber in here, but this is not Lumber Tycoon 2, okay? This is not Lumber Tycoon 2. Don't misread what I'm writing there. But I wanted to show this to you. Last night, Defaultio tweeted out that he was making a new game that has helicopters and everything else, and it was really awesome and that you have to have a controller to run it. So, i um, show you real quick, boom, like must have a game controller to pilot the helicopter. So I busted out one of my old um, Rock Candy controllers right here. It's from the Xbox 360 edition. Uh, I have a modified USB cable that runs to it. Um, you don't have to modify the cables. Uh, I just put a really, 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 really long USB cable on it. So anyhow, that way I could sit back from the TV and actually play and stuff like that. So I wanted to show you guys um, what this thing looks like. There we go. Oh, I gotta zoom in a little bit there. Oh, perfect. So I am now playing with the controller. Perfect. Okay. So I don't know what the name of this game is called. Hold on. Yeah, I do. It is called Helicopters. Oh, brilliant. <laughs> Cheers. Okay, um, so now that we have a controller plugged in, we can walk through here. So last night, around 4 a.m., there were a ton of people like, how do I get in? How do I get in? Just plug in a controller. Once you have a controller, you'll have access. And once you get in here, it is like a real helicopter. Um, I used to fly RC airplanes, radio-controlled cars, radio-controlled helicopters, stuff like, oh gosh, sorry, a whole bunch of stuff like that. So the, um, the solenoid, cylindrical, okay, the up and down is the left control stick, the left and right is the left control stick, and then to control this propeller on the back, this thing right here, the rudder, it's actually the right control stick, so left, right, and you can see the controls as they go. Um, to lift, it's the right, and to fall, it's the left, but the uh, the right one's the only one that we're gonna be using tonight. And if it if it's kicking off to the left or kicking off to the right, you can tr do what's called trim. So you can trim it. So, without further ado, let's take off on a helicopter ride, woo! So, here we are. Oh, just easy. Okay, as you can see, like my trim, just to the left here is a little much, so. Okay. Of course, that could be just because I'm taking off and stuff. No, nope. we got a little bit of left trim. Now, I tweeted that to him last night, like, hey, the trim's a little off, but that's, he, uh, he addressed that with one of the updates. So, right here, I'm gonna trim that direction. That's a little bit better. Might, might even go just a little bit more. So the, the helicopter itself was turning. There we go, now we're trimmed out. Hello, hello, can I drive? Uh, you can't, not unless you have a, uh, a controller. Hold on, I'll ask him. Uh, do you have a controller? Joypad? Gamepad? Xbox One. By the way, you can hook up Xbox One controllers via Bluetooth, but you have to have a Bluetooth radio. Most computers come with Bluetooth in them on the board. Anyhow, okay, the reason I thought this was pretty cool and amazing and fun was because it control like the controls are just like a helicopter. But as I was flying out here, I noticed something. I'm like, wait a second. I know this land. The land of lumber, Tycoon 2. So he used the base plates for from uh, lumber to kind of play and make. So we have an entire map of lumber at our disposal to like go and play and, and fly around on. So like right down there is the main area. <laughs> hey Code. Hey RR boss. Sorry, I'm I'm not chatting at the moment. I'm kind of showing off lumber. Oh, wait, is there lava down in the lava pit? Hold on. 
Uh, you will notice like there's no trees or anything like that, and that's because there's still um, a lot of scripts that aren't in the game that are normally in lumber. So, like, there's not going to be any boulders. We're not going to have any the, the the boulders falling down on us and stuff like that. But we can explore around if you have a controller and you have some time. You can absolutely go inside the volcano with a helicopter. I, oh, I wonder if he left the green box there. I am so curious now. Okay, hold on. No, 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 lift, 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 lift. No, 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 no. Oh, so close. Okay, we're going to have to scooch forward here. We don't want to fall in the lava. Although it might be funny. Here we are in the bottom of the lava pit. Look at that. Oh my gosh, this looks... This is awesome. I don't know. If I get closer, will it take me up? No, no. I'm stuck. Oh gosh. Oh... Oh, I burned! I burned! <laughs> okay, so the fire script is still inside the volcano. Uh, okay, let's let's go this direction. What's up, buddy? Hey, uh, you're the only other person in the game, so hang tight, and I will uh, I will pick you up. All right, generate a new helicopter for me. <gasps> it's purple, purpley purple. Hey, buddy. Okay, hold on. It's got to spin up. Can't just take off in a helicopter like a plane. Like, well, planes need to spin up too. So, hang tight, dude. I'll come get you. Hmm. Take a little bit of a coffee break. Hold on. Hold on. I'm coming down. Coming down. Coming down. Come on. Come on. Whoa. Where'd he go? Where are you, dude? There he is. Come on. Come on. Come on, hop in. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. There we go. Oh, oh, yep. Uh try again. Try there it is. Alright, let's take him for a an adventure. Hello. What's up, buddy? He's gonna be like, where are we going? So here's the Palm Islands. This is kinda cool. I think the snowy biomes over there. I don't know if. Uh, I wonder if the strange caves there. Are you the YouTuber? Yes, I am. And you're on my show. Welcome. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Ah. Oh, okay. If you flip upside down and you need to redirect, just hit the Y button. Boop. There you go. Yes, I am. I am that YouTuber. He's like, are you that YouTuber, Heath? Why, yes, yes I am. Dude, you're probably freaking out right now because it's like yesterday. Okay, so today is when it posts, but technically it's like yesterday. Oh gosh, oh gosh. Oh, look at the save, look at the save. Look, 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 that was awesome. That was awesome, awesome. Okay, okay, let's take it inside, take it in. Take it in, let's land on top. Oh no, no, no. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, I need to work on my landings a little bit, but boom. What's up, buddy? All right, let's go get the green box. <laughs> I don't know if I can get the green box or if it's even there, but that, that's going to be awesome if it is. Hmm. I wonder what happens if you get the green box while you're inside this game because it's a different database. I don't think it's going to be there. I'm just, I'm just taking a guess. I'm just going to guess that it's not going to be there. Oh, by the way, in uh, this game, it is R15 and not R8 or R6. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, R6. Had to think about the parts. Hey, buddy. You coming? All right. Let's go. I probably could have landed it down here, but um, the helicopter has a tendency to only max height on... Um, okay, and I'm going to switch over to mouse and keyboard. Boink. <clears throat> Which, by the way, you can do seamlessly. Come on, buddy. Let's go down here. There's going to be a little, a little... Oh, it's going to be a Code Primate statue. Just kidding. I'm just kidding. Well, I'm also not going to be able to look through the wall, am I? Oh, no. 
Okay, so we already know that the lava can kill you, so there's no way to get across that. Um, what about shift lock? Can we do a shift lock and look through? Let's go to settings. Shift lock, yes. Shift. Oh, oh, there it is. Ah, <laughs> the green box is inside his helico helicopter game. That was awesome. Uh, <clears throat> yes, I am. Sorry, I wasn't talking. I'm recording right now. You will be on video tomorrow. It's my life ass. <laughs> oh gosh. So there's there's the green box. <laughs> green box. He's like, yay! <laughs> our, our boss four. Uh, okay, I really don't like shift lock, so I only use it to look through walls and stuff. Let's turn that back off. Good. By the way, a lot of the old school uh, R6 stuff some of it still works um like shift lock looking through things but for the most part like oh i wonder no i can't get any of the axes because there's no axe shop i can't get the rookie axe because we don't have any of the items so yeah that's poopy <laughs> it's poopy but it's the, it's the base plate of lumber so wait what what, what did you say uh, I don't have a gamepad. Oh, no. Okay, if you don't have a gamepad, this game doesn't work. Like, you could still get in here and kind of run around. I guess if you wanted to come into the game and just walk, because the water will not hurt you. So, absolutely. If you wanted to come explore lumber and... Oh, by the way, the uh, the cave, the cave still exists. So if you wanted to go seek out the cave, there's no script to make it dark. Here, actually, let's go over there. I'll show it to you. All right, switching over to controller. There we go. Oh, I gotta, I gotta hide the chat, dude. Uh, there. Okay. And let's get ourselves circled around here. And here we go. Off we go. Off we go into the wild blue yonder. Why is it falling down so bad? Oh, no. There we go. Uh, so are these being added into Lumber Tycoon 2? I don't, I don't think so. I don't know. I'm going to say no, but um, we're going to have to reset because the front of these things get stuck in the ground. All right. Let's try this again. Hit the Y button. Nope. Nope, 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 nope. Come on. Nope, not working. Okay. Here. Reset. Oh, W reset. Reset. Blah. There we go. Okay. So, <clears throat> like I said, a lot of people ask for maps and stuff and how to's um, basically on where stuff is and how it's located and default to you thank you so much for using the uh the base map for um lumber because it gives me the opportunity to like show off things like this whoa, whoa, whoa. come on there you go he did have it covered with a like a metal metallic object thingy but it didn't work really well because every every time you're um the front would get stuck just like it did up there and that's because that area up there still has like a layer over it, kind of like a carpeting. But yeah, so it is a fun little game, and it's it's the best simulator for helicopters I've seen so far. All right, we gotta start slowing down. Slow down. Slow down. Slow down. Slow down. Blue wood. That that is correct, sir. We're actually not actually going to go get blue wood. Is here in lumber? Whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What happened? Okay, just just there. Go that way. There we go. We'll just keep going the direction that we want and then resetting. There we go. <laughs> we'll get down there eventually. Promise. And this is how to navigate the... Uh, the blue wood caves with a helicopter. <laughs> Woo. 
All right. Oh gosh. All right, I'm almost down. Uh, I don't know how well it's gonna work once we get down there. That's this is crazy. The maze. Yes, it is. <laughs> there we go. Nice and gentle. Whoa. Okay, that's that's gonna be way too lost. Where uh, where did we go? Okay, let's go this way. <laughs> all right, I'm already lost. I have no clue where I'm at. Where, where have you taken us, RR boss? This is your fault. <laughs> Anyhow, if you wanted to, you could. Um, that's that's about it. The simulator itself is really good. Like I'm not gonna lie, the the controls are really smooth. Um, it acts like a real helicopter. If you've ever flown an RC helicopter with no auto assist, it will it will do exactly what this thing does. Like where you start to tilt off to one side, you've got to correct that. It doesn't correct itself. Um, there are different states. Uh, let's see if I can get it to, to change modes. Uh, nope. There we go. There's easy, arcade, real, and stunt. All right, I don't, I don't know what the, okay, hold on. Let's go back and reset. Reset. <laughs> Boom. Reset. Reset. There we go. Okay. We're, re we're resetting. Taking it back. Welcome back. Welcome back. Welcome back. Hello, new spac dick. New space. NW space K. New spastic. Ooh. Okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay. Not really sure what this the this mode is. Stunt mode. Oh, oh, where are you, where are you going, dude? Come on, come on. Okay. Let him hop in. New stunt mode. Whoa. Okay. Well, that's not as expected. <laughs> mayday, mayday, we're going down. Okay, I I'm going to leave it right there. Thank you so much for watching this episode of Helicopters with me, Heath Haskins, Code Primate, as I show off the, uh, the kind of like flying thingy helicopter controls pads with RR Boss 4. Good job, dude. Well, well played. So, like I said, um, don't be mad. It's not lumber, but it is something built by Defaultio and something that's amazing and something that I think is really good. Love you guys very much. Have a great night, and we'll talk to you very soon. <gasps> Outro! Oh, wait, wait. I didn't do the thing. There we go. Click. <clears throat> oh, if you'd like one of those t-shirts with my face on it, check out the Hello Juniper link in the description down below. If you'd like one of those Rookery Axes, it's a, it's a wooden toy, um, check out the Sturdy Guns link in the description down below. Love you guys very much. Good night. Outro. Thank you.